name's Angel. Today I'm going to bring you my Black Friday haul. Black Friday is my favorite holiday, one of them at least, so I take it very seriously. Every Thanksgiving night I go to Target first to get all their DVDs because they have great deals on them and I bought other things so I'm going to show you guys what I bought and I went to a couple more stores. Let's just get started. So firstly I'm going to start with my DVD stack from Target because there's quite a few as you can see. First I have Fifty Shades Darker, The Secret Life of Pets, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, The Shack, La La Land, Big Little Lies, The Complete First Season, Modern Family, The Complete eighth season yes because i'm pretty sure i have every single season of modern family it's one of my favorite shows ever it's not on any streaming service so i have to own the dvds because i love the show and when i'm sad i just pop in the dvd the girl on the train everything everything why him which i actually recently saw on hbo and i thought it was so funny probably this year's most talked about movie get out it was incredible miracle on 34th street which i've definitely seen before but i don't know if i actually own a dvd all three of the Santa Claus, one, two, and three. Now some movies I have not seen, but they were so cheap that I couldn't pass it up. The Edge of Seventeen, Hidden Figures. I also really would like to read this book. Chef and Bad Moms. It's actually pretty small compared to my Black Friday DVD hauls of years past. Next from Target, I got this little earring set. It says slay all day, <laughs> but I mostly got it for these <laughs> like champagne flute earrings. I'm obsessed. I am obsessed with these K Bella masks. They're super cheap and really small and you can get a couple uses out of them. So I picked up a couple of these packs, although I already used one pack. This one has eggnog cream mask and festive spice mud mask. So I'll probably use these in December before Christmas. Elf, which is one of my favorite brands, had a sale and it was like buy one get one for these big sets. So I bought this brush set for myself and then possibly a gift for someone else. I didn't even really take advantage of the sale the other day, but I picked up a package of nail polish and it's got some really pretty colors in it. I chipped my nail polish that so you can't even tell, but it had some really nice colors and it was like 10 bucks, but I couldn't resist because I'm always buying more nail polish. My big Target purchase, which is not really like me because I spent quite a bit of money on it. It's something that I wanted for a while. I got a Nest cam for inside my house. So it's not an outdoor security camera, but it's indoor. I'm just an anxious person. So this will definitely calm my anxieties when I'm away from home. I can spy on my dog when she's inside and then when my cat's inside at night, just to keep an eye on things because I have crazy anxiety whenever I leave the house, worry that someone's gonna break in or something. So this will help calm it down. It was only about 125 because of my red card and cartwheel and all that stuff. And I think the original price was almost $200 so I'd say it was a pretty good deal and I think I'll get my money's worth out of this. The next store that I went to was of course Barnes & Noble. Also I had to work for eight hours on Black Friday so I had to be there anyway. I did get there a little bit early before my shift because I wanted to pick up a couple of autograph books because the signed copies are huge with our store at Black Friday. First I got Unqualified by Anna Ferris, and let's look at her pretty signature. It's really cute. I'm so excited to read this. The one that I really, really wanted. I got the last copy. I'm so stoked I did because I had serious anxiety about not being able to get it. Like I was so stressed that I wouldn't be able to get it. Tom Hanks, Uncommon Type. I love this man. He is my favorite actor for sure. He is a national treasure. It's signed by him. I'm so excited to read this. When it first came out, I really wanted to buy it, but then I found out that we'd be getting the autograph copy, so I held off. I'm so glad I did, because now I have this. Another sale we had going on was buy one, get one half off puzzles, and I am obsessed with puzzles. I hoard puzzles. I do all the puzzles. Can I say puzzles again? I got this cute little winter wonderland puzzle, and then I got a Thomas Kincaid Disney puzzle and I'm so excited to do these for Christmas and eventually like get them framed and hung up somewhere. So stoked about this. I'm always buying more puzzles. Our leather bound classics were on sale for 50% off so I got this one. It's Where the Sidewalk Ends, everything on it. Poems and Drawings by Shel Silverstein. I don't even think I read anything from Shel Silverstein before so I got this and it's really pretty. There's nice drawings. The pages are silver. It is gorgeous. And then another leather bound classic book that I got is our Christmas treasury. And I think it's just a Barnes and Noble thing. And this is a book 
It's gorgeous, first of all, look at that. It is a collection of Christmas stories and poems and illustrations. It's got a Christmas carol in it, which is my favorite, and some really pretty illustrations and a bunch of poems and everything. So I am so excited to read this for Christmas and it is just stunning all around. I love our leather bound classics. They are amazing. And this was only $10, so what a steal. Today I actually just got back from Ulta. I got this, what is this? Complexion Perfection three piece priming and setting kit. It was pretty cheap. It's got a beauty blender, which is always great to have. It's got face primer, hydrating, so I'm hoping that works for me, and then a setting spray, which I've recently gotten into, and it was pretty cheap, it's Ulta brand. Then I kind of splurged a little bit for me. I got this, is the brand Philosophy? Yeah, Philosophy brand. This is the Micro Delivery Exfoliating Facial Wash, and it was only $15, so I'm very excited to try this because I've heard great things about the brand. And then I also got this little ornament, and it's the Purity one, so it's a facial cleanser. So I will be trying out both of these and hopefully they do some magic for my skin. Then when I bought those, the cashier threw in this little gift. It's um, the anti-aging refresh. So I'll be trying that out too. I'm always excited to get little samples of things. And then my big splurge, which is totally unnecessary, but I love it and I will use it and I'm really excited about it. It's this makeup case. It was like $18, I want to say, which is pretty good. It's normally $25, but it says a $200 value, so I'd call that a good deal. The best part is inside. Oh, we've got layers upon, how should I do this? We've got layers upon layers of makeup and it goes out like this and like that and there's even more so we've got five different layers of makeup and we've got eyeshadows and lip gloss and blush and highlighter and all kinds of stuff that I don't know how to use but now I'm gonna learn and I mostly wanted it for eyeshadow I was on the hunt for some a nice eyeshadow palette so I just decided to get this whole thing it comes with brushes and everything and a nice little case so I don't have to worry about losing everything or getting it everywhere so I'm so stoked to use this and be trying out some different looks and it's a pretty pretty great deal so now the fun part comes I have a bunch of clothes from Target that I got and I'm just gonna hold them up because I don't feel like trying on everything so I will show you guys what I got first thing I have are these Grinch pajama pants they were seven bucks the Grinch is my favorite so these will be my Christmas pajamas I do love a good graphic sweater I love graphic tees as well statement sweater whatever you want to call it so I picked up a few of these this one says do all things with kindness, which I love. That's like my life motto. This other one says good vibes only. I also love life motto. And then this one is um, my personal life motto. Rosé and shine speaks for itself. Then I just got a bunch of long sleeve shirts, short sleeve shirts, great ones that I can wear to work because they're just simple. They don't have anything on it. I have this one. It's just a good like good pinkish shirt same shirt but it's just this brown color I'm not even gonna like fix everything it's just gonna get washed anyway but it's the good brown color it's a good neutral then I got just a bunch of regular shirts I have this navy one it's really nice and soft and like stretchy also got it in forest green it's kind of hard to tell with this light but it's like a dark green then I got the same one I'm telling you they had good deals on these shirts and this is like a like a royalish blue lightish blue whatever then this is just a simple long sleeve t-shirt it's like this blue gray stripey thing and then I picked up this boyfriend cardigan it's like tan with rainbow little polka dots on it I'm sure you've seen this pattern before I don't think you can ever have too many cardigans I really like this one when I tried it on I think I'm gonna keep it I am taking back a couple things that are aren't in this video but I really like this one I think it can be worn with a lot of stuff and it's also really great for work and then the last thing I have is this sweater it is black and there are rainbow glitter dots on it and it's gorgeous and it is so perfect for New Year's Eve and Christmas parties and every kind of fancy event and like where was this when I went to New York to see Hamilton and needed a nice top that also kept me warm but I really fell in love with this and I'm so glad it's mine. It's a little bit scratchy on the inside because of the glitter, the sparkles. Beauty is worth it. Beauty's pain, right? I think that's everything. There are a few things that I didn't show in this video. I got a 
pair of headphones from Target for like $12. I got a new pillow for $3. Then I bought some stuff that I'm going to be donating. I got this giant teddy bear, which is amazing. They're only $10 at Target and I really wanted one for myself as well, but I don't have any room for it. So I'm gonna donate that. If you know of any good kids charities in the West Palm Beach area, please let me know because I'm looking for one. I spent too much money on Black Friday and there's also Cyber Monday. So that could be dangerous. It was a great time. I love Black Friday. I can't believe it's over already. I can't believe I survived working it for eight hours. It was actually not as bad as I thought it would be and I'm really relieved. A successful Black Friday in the book. So I'll see you next year, Black Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you found any really great Black Friday deals and what you bought. You found some good Cyber Monday deals as well, Small Business Saturday, all that good stuff. Just let me know what you've been buying lately and what I should add to my Christmas list now because that's gonna be next. So thanks again for checking out this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Goodbye!